everybody, J.M. Mannion here for the IFBB Pro League interview series. I am here with your eight-time Fitness Olympia champion, Adela Garcia, and your two-time Bikini Olympia champion, Angelica Texara. So ladies, first time you two have met. Yes. Right? <laughs> Finally. Now you're, you're in Texas, like Adela's in Texas. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. So the first question is, what's up with the tiara? <laughs> Guys, this is my first tiara in my whole career. So even though after seven years competing, all my titles, today I was on stage and they're like, okay, hold this chart. I'm like, oh, I wish I had one in my career. And then they brought, okay, what? You don't have one? I'm gonna give you one right now. So my first tiara in my whole career. So you I'm won the tiara. like a queen. <laughs> so you won the tiara for uh, giving out trophies and emceeing. Yeah, that's what I want today, yes. for emceeing. <laughs> <laughs> and giving trophies in the seminar, so... I there you go. <laughs> now, do you have a tiara? No, I don't. I'm not very happy about that. <laughs> I want a tiara. I think I'm gonna fight you for that one, because it's, no. it's really pretty, actually, and I like big ones like that, too. It took me too long to get my first one. Come on. I might give you one whenever you come to my show, then. Okay. We're gonna get some. We're okay. Gonna wait, wait, so are you both gonna wear one? I think, one. yeah, no, I'm gonna have, I'm no, I'm gonna have one for you. you. Cause you are a truly change, you are a truly queen. Just for the interview though. Oh my God. Let me see how this, does that You are a queen, right? you deserve it. Oh, I feel like a queen, <laughs> dancing queen. Look at that. <laughs> it feels so good. Have you ever tried one on? No, I don't need to. Uh, oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my God, they're so pretty. So I pretty. Yes, I need to get one. But I, it's, I know it's I yours. Is at your show in two weeks, like right? In Austin, Texas. Yeah. Deal. Okay, so let's get serious here for a minute. You were both going back to the Olympia. Okay. And you're both chasing the title again. For sure. Yes. Right. We're going for the title. Yeah, I mean, if you're not gonna go for that title, why even go? I mean, you're, we, we, we all friends. We, I mean, we're different division, but all the fitness girls, I mean, we love each other, but at the same time, whenever we get to that stage, it's like, we forget who is who. We're just there to, to go for that title, you know? So, and I've been away for uh, seven years. I retired in 2013, and coming back again, I mean, it's been a challenging year, of course, with the pandemic and everything else, but let me tell you something, when you want something bad enough, you find ways to train, to get in there and get it together. And um, I'm super excited for, for this Olympia. Do you feel the same way? I feel the same way. I'm super excited. Uh, I haven't taken time off like she did, but uh, last Olympia, I didn't feel my best on stage. I left the Olympia feeling that I need to come back and do better and come on stage and get my title back. So this, you know, the whole year I did the Arnold, but the focus was always coming back to the Olympia and getting my title back. So I'm hungry and we almost there, 10 weeks. How hungry are you? Super hungry, like super. I could eat a pizza, a burger, like. All at once? Everything at once. <laughs> well, this, this girl could always eat. Yeah, you know, that, that's, that's a, one of the things we know how to do it. I mean, it's like, it's like, like, it's like, it, it's like I'm hungry and I don't want to eat you. You know how it is. Like, you, you're looking kind of nice and I'm, I'm like so hungry right now. But no, seriously, it's like at the same time, like whenever we're getting ready to, to, to a, for a contest, especially the Olympia, it's like, yeah, food is good. It looks very attractive, but at the same time, you got to think about, uh, if I'm eating this, what about the other person? What are they doing? So, you know, this is some serious business. And I, I think this Olympia is going to be incredible because there's so many other champions coming back. Well, that's what I was going to say. What's interesting yeah, about so both of your divisions, fitness and bikini, is, and I think this is the first time ever, where each division has three bikini Olympia champions, three fitness Olympia three champions. Fitness Olympia wow. Champions. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. That's true. Yeah, we like with all of us, like I have eight, and then Oksana has four, and Whitney has a two. So, I mean, like, how many is that? 14? I mean, that's a lot yeah. of titles. For me, Ashley has three, I have two, Isa has one. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, I mean six. Four is just completely. Six titles right there. Yeah. 
And especially also Planet Hollywood. I mean, it cannot get any better than that. This is just going to be incredible. Going back to the strip again in Las Vegas. I remember when I first competed at the Olympia, it was at the... What's the name of that hotel? Um, what, the Orleans? The Orleans. Yeah. Yeah. Well, it was at the Orleans, and now it's like, it's like completely different. Like they said, new era. So I'm super excited to be part of it. And looking forward. Yes, to me too. I can't wait. I think it's going to be, like we say, the new era because everything's going to be better for this Olympia. I'm sure about that. I'm super excited. So, so can we say that, like the, the old cliche, everything old is new again? I think so, yeah. <laughs> yeah. No old is Every, new uh, again? Yeah. Everything old is new again. Yeah. Everything, do you mean, everything comes back. It comes back around. So, I mean, I just say, don't be thinking because mean a new era means new something. No, it comes around. You never know. We're coming around again. It's like we're giving around, you know. So, we'll be yeah. well, I great. love the idea, yes. Yeah. For sure. I like that, too. Mm -hmm. yeah. Seriously, do. <laughs> Wait, so you just want me to, to walk out so you, you can wrestle her for that? She's jealous. Actually, I think that you would lose. Um, She's taller than you. How tall are you? I'm four. Oh, okay. I'm four oh. seven, so I'm sorry. Seven, no. Mm -hmm. no. Four seven, maybe. <laughs> no, come on. I'm five one, for real. For real, okay. No, but I, I'm excited. I mean, she's coming to my show in two weeks, and it's nice to have her here because now it's like, I, I think we message each other, yeah. but finally meeting her in person, I always, I've been a fan and it's, it's just nice, you know, it's like we just, it's, it's, it's like a family, family reunion and it just, it's just good to help each other out and, and I appreciate everything that you do for the sport because it's not about, a lot of the things that people need to understand, it's not just about going there and winning. Um, we have, I mean, this sport has given me so much. I took some time off. It, it was not because I didn't want to be involved. It's just I had to take care of myself. I had to take care of me mentally before I can come back. But I, and JM knows, I, I mean, we met each other a long time ago. and It was the last century. Yeah, the last, <laughs> a lot, yes. <laughs> but, I mean, like, this sport has given me so much. You that turned pro in the last century. 1999, man. That's a long time ago. So Were we partying like it was 1999? We used to party, too, though. <laughs> we did. We used to party, too, man. We used to have such a good time. But, no, it's like, it's about you got to give back. I mean, and it's from the heart, not just because you, you're expecting something back. You got to give back to the sport. So I have always appreciate everything. And being back again around, being back to the Olympia stage and meeting a bunch of different new people, athletes, it's gonna be just, it's just a great feeling. Thank you. Yes, I agree 100%. We gotta give back. This sport gives us so many opportunities, like it literally changed my life. So I did like so many shows with the NPC and uh, I just saw my career like evolving and evolving. And uh, today I have so many opportunities I have sponsors, I travel the whole world, and I, you know, I have friends for life. And I just, you know, I, I say, give it back. Don't do it just because you want something in return. Do it because you love the sport, the sport that did so much for you. And uh, just give back, give back to the athletes that look up to you. Yes. And uh, be there for them, be there for the sport. That's how we grow, the sport grows, and we're gonna grow together. We're gonna keep growing and evolving. So, right. yeah. Well, I think this is the perfect way to wind this up for now. Yeah. And I will see both of you at Planet Hollywood in the Zappos Theater. Yes, you will. You'll be okay. ready, 10 weeks. 10 weeks, thank you. All right, Jay Mannion. And Chelka Teixeira. Adela Garcia. Signing out for NPC News Online. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.